So, ja. Dann geht's jetzt erstmal weiter, würde ich sagen. Wäre schön. Macht es gut, Officer. Äh, wie ist er? Frick. Frick, Frick, Mick. Jo, was machen wir jetzt? Gehen wir doch mal hier hin. Eine Bar, wie wir sehen. Einen guten Schluck haben wir uns auch jetzt verdient, nachdem wir ein bisschen viel gequatscht haben. Können wir hier gleich noch weiter quatschen. Was macht er da? A street drummer has found a spot outside the Napoleon House. Ein Straßentrommler. Mm -hmm. Several fine old oils line the walls at the bar. Mm -hmm. Several fine. Okay, mehr sagst du dazu nicht. A chandelier cast a dim glow over the room. Mm -hmm. A stereo and some old jazz albums occupy the back shelf. Auf was? Gabriel can. Na gut. Gabriel. Bested. You're a sore loser, Sam. <lacht> Gabriel cannot reach the back shelf. Gabriel. Wieso kommt er da nicht ran? Steht doch direkt davor. Na gut. <lacht> Oder sehe ich da was falsch? Benutzt doch mal die. That Anlage. doesn't work that way. Nicht? Ja, gut, was haben wir denn hier noch? An unhappy looking man explores the dangers of drinking alone. Oh, na. Dann mutter wir den Namen Snow auf, huh? What's up? Buddy, I think the place you're looking for is down <laughs> on Bourbon. Da so. What's up, buddy? Na gut. Um. Can I ask you some questions? I'm here to relax, friend. Buzz off. Right. Buzz off. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Uh, then... Fancy old liquor bottles contribute to the general decor. Mm -hmm. A small table recently deserted hold the remains of someone's dream. No, it's not perfect. There is nothing to operate there. So. Gabriel has spent enough hours sitting around in this bar. Ach so, also nicht hinsetzen. Na gut. Gabriel doesn't have a good reason to move the table. <lacht> What do I need with a table? Das weiß ich auch nicht. Ich dachte, du nimmst den Drink, der da steht. What do I need with Na gut. Dann hätten wir hier noch... The bar is a 19th century antique in lovingly polished walnut. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Und hier haben wir den Namensgeber des, dieser Bar. It's a Boston Napoleon. How apropos. <coughs> It's a... Jo. Kann man die benutzen? Abel was I, ere I saw Elba. <coughs> <lacht> Abel was I, er I saw Elba. <lacht> ja, wer war das wohl mit Napoleon? Gabriel doesn't have time to rearrange the stuff in the bar. Woher oh ja, der Satz allerdings stand, weil ich auch nicht. If Gabriel tried to take the hair, Stonewall would be on him like ducks on a June bug. Mhm. Gabriel cannot open or close that. Ach, schade. So, ähm, ja, als erstes sehen wir natürlich diese wunderschönen Beine. A young woman is enjoying drinks with her boyfriend. Hmm, kinda cute. Na. <lacht> nicht? That would not work too well on a human being. Nicht? Ach so. I don't think I want to do that. Mit sind verschieden. You're a sore loser, Sam. Ja, haltet doch mal die Klappe. Ich versuch doch hier gerade die Frau anzugraben. Can I ask you some questions? 
Sure. You want to know my son? Uh, <clears throat> on second thought, I don't think you could help. Forget it. Hello there. Excuse me. I was talking to the lady. And she was listening raptly, I'm sure. <clears throat> Das zeigt uns dann ja auf hier, oder? Hello there. Excuse me. Gut, okay. Gabriel's already created enough bad karma <lacht> in this bar. <lacht> das ist doch so was ich wert. I hmm. Ja, okay, okay, okay. Can I ask you some questions? Sure. He Na ah. gut, okay, einmal reicht ja auch. Gabriel doesn't want to stick. Nothing like a good game of chess, huh? Yeah, well, this isn't a good game. This is torture. Oh well, have fun. Come on, come on! I'm growing fungus already. Shut up! You are a fungus. Fungus. Mit Pilz startet doch gerade gar nichts. A man in a loud tie stares morosely at a chessboard. Mhm. Und er auch? A sharp-eyed gentleman in a grey sports coat hunches over a chessboard, chuckling to himself. Und der Schachbord selber? That tabletop has an inlaid chessboard. Mhm. Ja, ähm... Ich denke mal, mit dem können wir nicht großartig reden, oder? Excuse me, I hate to interrupt your game, but could I ask you a few questions? What game? This isn't a game, it's a slaughter! He's right, you know, so let me die in peace, would you? Mhm. Und du? You peck of wood? Sorry to bother you, but could I ask you a few questions? I'm not that shady type, am I, Sam? No, you old bastard, you're not. Besides, I'm busy sucking poor old Sam dry. Go bug someone else! Ah, uh, you're a real sweetheart, Marcus, you bastard. Oh, bastard? Das, das mögt er wohl. Na gut, dann bleibt uns wohl nur der Barkeeper. Oder? Gabriel and the bartender are old pals. His name is Stonewall King. And he knows everybody round here. Na, so machst du umso besser. Dann sagen wir mal hallo. Hi, how's it going? It's been worse. <lacht> Business picking up? Some. Mostly locals, as usual. <lacht> you bastard! You're a sore loop! Yeah. You ever get tired of tending bar for a living? Never thought much about doing anything else. Mm -hmm. The weather's pretty crappy out there today. I wouldn't know. I'd never get out of here before dark. <coughs> This looks like a lively crowd. Lively crowds are trouble. These guys just sit and drink. That makes me happy. Mm, und geht gut. Hi, how's it going? It's been... Okay, so I'm going to ask you a question. Could I ask you a few questions? Sure. I'm not too busy at the moment. Na, umso prima, besser. Der sieht doch irgendwie jünger aus als gerade auf dem Dings. In der... Äh, Totale. Na, dann schauen wir mal. What can you tell me about Voodoo? Voodoo? <laughs> I don't believe in it myself. I invented a drink once called Lavo's Tomb. But it wasn't very popular. Some people do believe, though. Even some of our regulars here at Napoleon House. Mm -hmm. um, What can you tell me? I'm no expert. You might want to talk to someone who believes in it. Mm -hmm. What can you tell me about voodoo? I'm no expert. You might want to talk to someone who believes in it. Okay. So, What do you know about the voodoo murders? It's all over the papers. Some kind of serial killings. Mm -hmm. What do you know about 
the voodoo. They say a lot of voodoo stuff is found near the bodies. Uh -huh. What do you know about the voodoo murders? Everybody's talking about them. It's starting to scare off the tourists. What do you know about the voodoo murders? Everybody's talking. Nee. Good. What can you tell me about New Orleans? Greatest city in the world. I'd never want to live anywhere else. What can you tell me about New Orleans? <clears throat> this city must get a million tourists a year, especially around Mardi Gras. Mm -hmm. What can you tell me about New Orleans? A lot of people come here because they think it's mysterious. I'm going to talk about voodoo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What can you tell me about New Orleans? You should probably find a book on the subject, you know? <laughs> Cute. Have you ever heard of a Schutten Jaeger? Never heard of it. No. Uh -huh. Have you ever heard of a Schutten Jaeger? Never heard of it. No, it's not. Tell me about yourself. A good bartender listens to other people's life stories without telling his own. Tell me about yourself. A good bartender... What can you tell me about your regulars in here? This crowd, the ones you see, are mostly regulars. That guy and girl in the corner come here a lot. When they're not fighting, they're all over each other. In other words, they're in love. What can you tell me about your regulars in here? See those old guys at the chess table? That's Sam and Marcus. They played every day for 20 years. <laughs> Sam, the one with the purple jacket, he's lost every one of those games. It's not that he's a bad player. I've seen him beat guys twice as good as Marcus. But Marcus has Sam so psyched out, he loses his nerve every time. By the way, Sam, the chess player, he's into that voodoo stuff. He's always talking about spells and gree, -gree and stuff. Really? Thanks. Mm-hmm. Yo, What can you tell me about your regulars in here? I'd call you a regular, Gabe. And one of our local writer celebrities, too. Been coming in here, what? Ten years now? Mm, don't remind me. We're still waiting for that best seller. Don't hold your breath. Yeah. What can you tell me about your regulars in here? That's about all I can say about this crowd. Alles klar. Na gut, dann noch zum Straßenmusiker. Tell me about the street musicians around here. I like music as much as the next guy, but they get pretty monotonous sometimes, you know? Like that drummer right outside. They say there's been a drummer outside Napoleon House since the day it opened. I like drums, but this character really gets on my nerves. It sounds like the same thing over and over. I just want to say, enough already. Sounds like my life. <laughs> So what has Sam told you about voodoo? Well, about 50 years ago, Sam was too shy to talk to this pretty girl he was in love with. He went to a voodooine and had her make him a love charm. It was a little pouch that he had to bury under the girl's front porch. Well, he buried the pouch, and the next day, he went up and talked to the girl. And, sure enough, she didn't reject him. Now she's his wife. <laughs> Poor guy. <lacht> ja, da gab's Punkte für, dann würde ich sagen. Quatsch, weil den vielleicht auch nochmal an. Aber das machen wir beim nächsten Mal. Nicht wahr?